So what are the major risk factors for Alzheimer's disease? And when should you be concerned? If your memory is worse than it was 10 years ago, you should be concerned. Now, everybody as we age, you know, we might forget names or go into Rome and forget why are we here. But if that is happening more and more, you want to be concerned. I have a Bright Minds acronym that if you want to keep your brain healthy or rescue it, you have to prevent or treat the 11 major risk factors. So if you want to know the risk factors, it's low blood flow, and that is hypertension and smoking, alcohol use, marijuana use, retirement and aging. The older you get, the more serious you need to be about brain health. Inflammation, check your C-reactive protein. And then inflammation is gum disease. Genetics, if you have Alzheimer's disease in your family, you should be on an Alzheimer's prevention program every day of your life. Head trauma, toxins, again, alcohol, but also general anesthesia, mental health problems. If you're depressed, doubles the risk of Alzheimer's in women, quadruples it in men. Um, the second eye is immunity and infections. We know COVID and Lyme and herpes and Epstein-Barr all increase the risk of dementia. N is neurohormone disorders, low testosterone, low estrogen and progesterone in women, low thyroid or risk factors, diabetes, one of the biggest risk factors having diabetes and or being overweight or obese. And if you have sleep apnea, it triples the risk. So how's that?